Hi guys, Snake Daughter here. Welcome back to Snake's New Adventure. This is episode 13. It's been going well. I'm quite happy with the progress we've made. In the last few episodes, we've made a brand new sorting room just down there, over there, down there. We've also made our, um, our, our, what are they called? They're our, what are they called? The free runners, that's right. That's what they're called, the free runners. I was thinking feather falling, same difference. Free runners, we've made our jetpack, our armoured jetpack, um, which hasn't got any power yet. Um, we've made we've made good progress. We made lots of we made the digital miner, which is in my inventory. We made our digital miner. We've got lots of stuff to to carry on with to get more stuff done. But the next thing I want to do is get this um, this uh, this uh, thing here, this little section here, the the pump, the electric pump, and the electrolytic separator sorted. I've run more power cables round, so they run all the way round now down to the bottom here. We're going to plug the pump in there, which is now going to start sucking up water. Look straight away, it sucked up water. And then we put the electrolytic separator on top, and there you go. Look, we have um, we have water going into the electrolytic separator. And then hopefully, why have we got no power? Has power got to go into that as well? Have I made a mistake? Have I made a mistake? I might have made a mistake. Hang on a second. Hang on a second. I thought that would work, but it, it hasn't. So, do we need power running into the to that as well? Let me just see if we need to get another um, power. I think we've got a couple of power cables left. I think I'm sure somewhere have we or not have we have we have we but so you i must have used them all that's okay we can make some more um need some universal cable was uh universal cable universal cable it was maybe just with steel and redstone wasn't it yeah don't know why i don't remember that i've made enough of them uh steel one one two and a bit of redstone thank you let's go and make a couple more and um, we can just i think i don't know why that didn't work I, sh I tested it and i thought it worked but Obviously not. Oh, my crafting table's down here. Crafting table's down here. Um, Right. Plug you in there and there. You in there. Makes another eight of these. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Right. Let's plug that in. I don't know why that didn't work. Don't know why that didn't work. I, I thought that would have would have done its thing, but that's okay. If we've got to do that. There we go. We've got power now. That's fine. Right. So we should be making, there we go, we are making hydrogen and we're making oxygen. Now this is updated, this mod pack, from when I used it last, this is updated. I can, I think you can, you can turn off dumping excess oxygen, I think you can do it, but we don't need to now because, yeah look, you can dump, you can dump, um, yeah, you can dump your oxygen or you can dump the hydrogen. I don't need to. I think you could either have one or the other last time, but, mm, big sip of tea. We don't really need to anymore because I can just, just take this off. And it only had one slot before to put things in, but now you can put it into the slot that you actually want your item to go in. So now, I can add hydrogen into this bad boy. Um, it's going to just slow. It's not going to go up, obviously. This isn't going to go up because it's going straight into the armor jetpack. So we're going to let that happen. Get that loaded up. Um, while I was setting myself up, I was getting this um, all of this uh, iron that we smelted or pul pulverized last time uh, ready. Get that done. So we've got as much iron as we can, because you never know when you're going to need it. I'll go and stick this into the uh, into the sorting system. Uh, iron, iron, iron. Where's my iron? Where's my iron? Oh, there is my iron there. Boom. There we go. There's our iron. More iron. We've got some pulverized nickel, enriched iron up there. We've got we've got all of us. I'm I'm so pleased we've got all of this stuff put away now. It makes life so much easier. Um, just being able to. Uh, just knowing that you've got it all all sorted. How's this coming along? This is going to take some time to uh, to, to to cook and to get ready. I think it's going to take a little bit of time. Um, digital miner. So that's our next option. Now I am wondering whether we should literally just dig down, like in a in a corner here, or just dig down from here maybe, and just have a place where our digital miner goes um, that we can keep safe. So literally, I could just literally dig straight down here, for example. Once the uh, oh, I've got a hole in me wall um once me once the uh once the jet pack's done let you dig down there um and then uh, i'm just going to cook up one piece of this let's just make stone there um yeah dig straight down and then have a place where we can have a place where we can just put the digital miner underground to start with put an ender chest there and chest up in the base and that will literally fill up with stuff and we can take it out as it fills um and go from there i think that's the that's what i'd like to do i think we need power for the digital miner I think so. That's something we are going to need to sort out some form of power system for it, um, which means we may have to run 
power cables down off of this straight down to it, which means we're not going to go too far. We're at level we're at level seventy here, so I reckon if we started from zero to say forty, it won't get our, it won't be a cause us a problem or anything um, in terms of breaking our world. Let's just grab the. Uh, I should be dangerous if I do that, wouldn't it? Four thousand. That should last quite a while, actually. That should last quite a while. Mm, yeah, let's just try it. Let's just try it for now. Let's put a, put a jetpack on, and we're going to dig down. Let's hope we don't get stuck, because if I do, I'm in trouble. And we'll go down to like level 40. And hopefully we'll have enough oomph to get back. So we're at level 60 now. Might get a little bit dark for you guys, but you'll see we've got level 50 now. Look how quick we can dig with this. We're about to fall into a base or something. Level 40 now. There you go. Right, so we're at level. Let's go down to 30. And we'll do from level 30. We'll do from level 30. We're at 32 here. So we'll make a little area that is uh that is that is safe and we can put our digital miner in here um, right we need to go up a couple of levels just because digital miner takes up a bit of room there we go I can hear a zombie or three which means we're obviously spawned we're obviously near some kind of either an opening or we're near a we're near a, a dungeon maybe I don't know There we go. Right, so we have enough room for our digital miner here. I think I might actually go. I might go a couple more, a couple more back actually. Boom, 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 boom. Oh look, we've we've come right out into a. Uh, which is handy actually. Actually, that's, that that actually isn't too bad. I'm quite happy with that. Into a little mine area, or is it a ravine? It might even be a ravine. I'll just make it like that so no one can get in there apart from maybe um, maybe zombies and stuff can get in here. Yeah, look, this is actually quite a good little area here. This is this is a nice little spot to... So you can see all the stuff that we're going to be picking up, all these ores that we are going to be picking up. Um, there we go, we can fly. Yeah, it's not taking up too much room. I might just I might just wall this off for now um, just so we, we are safe. i just use it with cobble so we know where the opening is. Uh, there we go. So well, this is a safe room. We'll put some torches down in here as well, just so we're not going to be uh, attacked at all or get any mobs spawning. Hopefully, there we go. So we've got torches in here. So we can put down our digital miner. Let's stick that down. Let's stick you down right uh, there. Oh wow, it's a big, I forget how big this machine is. You forget just how big the digital miner is. So we've got our little uh, our escape corner here, which is fine. Okay, so we need a chest on top of there, which has to be the ender chest. That will pump out. Yeah, we're going to need to put power in here, aren't we? So we need to bring some power down here as well. So let's bring, let's just go up again. And we'll put some power off of the, uh, off of the back wall. There we go, because power can come straight down. Oh, hello. Power can come straight down there. If I just did you drop down there and dig straight the way down to the bottom. Till we come through into the room, which is the same sort of distance down as we just dug, obviously, because it's the same size room. We should. There we go. Perfect. That actually drops perfectly to where the power is. So if I start, if I start powering this up, oh, that's not right. Let's quickly break you. Let's go up here. We need to lock. Oh, really? We need a lot more power, but it'll be okay. Uh, you can see how useful the. Uh, how useful the jetpack is here. Yeah, we are going to need quite a bit of um, more cabling here, but we can get that. That's not a big deal. Let's quickly get that. We need to use a bit more. A redstone, a bit more. We need probably another 16, I reckon we'll do it. So one, two, and then uh, one, two, three, four. Perfect. Let's make some more of these power cables. We probably need to get another um, uh, wind generator as well, I would imagine, because we're probably going to be using quite a lot of power now. We may have to make another generator, because I think the second one will help. So I think that's what we'll do. Hopefully this will be enough. It may not quite be enough, actually. We might have to make some more. One. Yeah, we need lots, lots more, actually. Lots more. Right, another 16 will do it. That will give us enough to make, uh, to give us the uh, extra core uh, power upstairs for the generator. Although I might be able to get away with one, actually, for that. Right, let's make another 16. One, two. We'll always need them. One, two. There we go. We've got enough steel. Got yeah, enough steel. Did I only pick up two? I did pick up two. I said one, two, didn't I? 
And there we go. Long one, there we go. Right, we've got another 16. Perfect. Right, that should that'll be enough now to get that down there. Then we need to make our ender chest. Then I think we can start mining, if I'm not mistaken. I think we can now then start mining. Blimey, I thought that would be enough, but it's... Or is it yet? Yeah, might just be enough. It is perfect. Okay, cool. So let's put... Um, where's our blocks here? They put them back in there, so we need... Some of you, and then we need that there and that there. So now our digital miner should be should be powered. It is. There we go. It's got power. Perfect. So we can fly back up again quickly. We've got enough of this for now. Let's get the ender chest made. Uh, let's just remind ourselves what we need. I think we need some wool, which I've got some wool. Have I need one wool? I may have enough, may not. I'm not sure. Uh, ender chests. Ender chest. There we go. Right. Ender chest. We're making these ones. So blaze rods, obsidian, wool, chest, ender pearl. We've got enough stuff. Um, I'm not sure if we've got any spare chests or anything. Let's just have a quick look in the thing. See if we have. I don't think we have there. No, we haven't, but that's okay. So we need some, and we need them. Uh, we need one, two, three, four of them. Actually, we need two, don't we? Let's make two. Then we can, I haven't got to keep going up to the to the surface, so we'll need another bit of wool, which isn't a problem. We can go and get another bit of wool. I'm sure we can find a sheep out there to to just use. I won't say kill, because it'd be bad if we're not we're not killing him, we're we're using him. Uh and oh yeah, we need the obsidian and the chest. We need obsidian. I've only got two bits of obsidian as well. That's very, very annoying. Let's go down to the thing and get that as well. So, uh a chest first. A chest first. Uh one, two. Oh no, didn't want you. Oh, I just pretty. <laughs> I don't know my own strength. I don't know my own strength. Look at that. I've just broken the thing. Hang on. Let's put that back. Let's put you back. Oakwood planks. There we go. Um, we need to make some more chests. So I need some oak planks. Where are our oak planks? Have we got, I've got any oak? Have I used all my own? No, I haven't. I was going to say. I thought I'd use all my oak planks then. Use that. There we go. Make a couple of chests because we need them. Boom, 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 boom. Haven't got enough, silly idiots. Oak wood, boom, there we go. Make another one of them. Uh, 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 uh. Two chests. Okay, so we've got everything now I think we can make one with, I think. Apart from the wool, I didn't take out wool. Didn't take the wool out, right, so there's one. There's one in the chest, we can put that down. Then we need to go outside and find um, a sheep and a thingy majig and the obsidian. Perfect, right, so we can put, we could we can put a normal chest on top, but that will fill up too quickly and then it won't transport. So if we put an ender chest on top of here like so, that should now pump straight straight into the digital miner. We can turn it on, we can do all the stuff, which is good. Um, right, let's go and find our, I could start mining now, but I, I'll wait till the, I'll wait till we go and get the stuff we need. Right, we've got enough jetpack juice to fly off and, um, and if I, if, I, if I now combine this with the glider now, we can fly without having to use too much um, hydrogen, which is always a good thing. Right, let's see if we can find a sheep while we're just hovering around. Look at this place over here. This is fancy, isn't it? Um, just need to find a sheep. Just one little sol solitary sheep that we can use for wool. There's probably other ways of getting wool. Oh, I'm being shot. Be shot from that distance. That was quite good shooting. Blimey, that was an accurate. This might that might have been a biome that was uh, biomes of plenty that's now gone a bit naked. That's the only problem with moving the moving the server over to my own my own um, local area is that I've lost I've lost that. Also, oh, there's a sheep. Look. Also, it says I'm on day one, which is a bit annoying. Which I'm not on day one. We know we're not on day one. Excuse me, Mister Sheep. I need to use you. Thank you very much. I'm not going to kill any others. Because we don't need to. So let's fly back to base, which is either in this direction. Could teleport, but we might as well just fly back while we're there. Can I hold down the shift key to fly quicker? I think I can. Right. Where is our base? Here it is. Look, perfect. Okay. Say hello to Mrs. Buttersworth. Morning! We'll get you a friend, promise. I keep saying that, but I do promise. Right, let's get back in. Right, let's, um, we've got to go and get obsidian still as well. So we've got to go and get that. Actually, I can't do anything else about the obsidian, can I? Hello, lads. All right, I'm going to go down to uh, this one here. I know there is some, there is obsidian down in the, or lava in the other area, but we might as well go and get this obsidian because we know where it is. Let's go and get you. Boom, boom, boom. 
Uh, which way was it? This way, wasn't it? There we go, down here. There we go. Perfect. We'll make obsidian much, much quicker now. Get off. Get off, get off. There's my obsidian, little obsidian farm thing here that we were using. I, oh, you stop it now, will you? Goodness sake, honestly. Honestly, right. I couldn't have got the other stuff from here. Where did I get the other stuff from then? It was around here. Just grab you. Boom, there you go. One. And another one. Just grab you there. Much quicker as well. Look, boom. Done. There we go. We've got two bits of obsidian. Let's uh, let's go back up. We could we could uh, we could go up the uh, the teleport way, but as we are, is it this way or is it no this way? This way? No. Hang on, brain. This way. There we go. There we go. Come on out. We go. Oh yeah, remember that the uh, free runners as well let you uh, let you hop up one block highs as well, which is really good. Which is very handy. Very very handy. Right. Um. Hello, just going to kill you because, there you go, see you later mate. And uh, you as well, see you later with your armour on, bye. No, you don't want any, okay, that's good. It's one good thing, so we are pretty much, um, we are pretty much safe now from most mobs. Obviously a creeper could still kill us. Right, that's good, we've got everything we need now for the second of our ender chests. Then we can bring one up here and we are then golden. So, ender chest, boom, second one, done. So now, if I put one here, and all you're doing is, I think the colour codedness will literally make them work with each other, so if you've got an orange one, it'll only work with orange ones, so you can do different different chests for different things. Where should we put this? Should we put this up here? Or should we literally bring it down here? Probably should bring it down here, really, shouldn't we? But I've got nowhere to put it. I've got nowhere to put it, really. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll just leave it in here for now. We'll leave it here. Uh, we'll put it at the end here we'll put it, just put it there for now then anything that comes down so now i should be able to go down and set up our ender chest our um, digital miner to uh, to work so if i click on it i then say i want to eject it so i definitely want to um i want to eject yes because otherwise it would just stay in this inventory that's no good um silk touch we could, if you want to if you want to get um things like you want to keep for diamonds for example you want to keep the ore then you can silk touch it or same with stone if you want stone you can silk touch it same with coal things like that um, but obviously we don't not particularly bother about that. Auto pull, yes, we want to do that as well. I think so that will put it straight into the ender chest. Um, right, configure. So now we need a new figure. We want radius of ten, minimum zero, and we want to make the maximum thirty because we don't want to go any any higher than thirty. Otherwise, our world around us will start disappearing. Um, so that's done. New filter, and I think it is uh, or dictionary. I think you can do like asterisk or, and I think. I, th I think, is that right? Or is it or star maybe? Or star is it? I can't remember. Save. Yeah, there we go. Or star. So now it's going to take out all the ores that have or in the name. So everything that's to do with all diamonds, all that stuff, which is what we want to start with. I'm going to keep it at 10 radius for now um, because I think that's probably enough. It will tell me how many. It says none. I'm going to mine. How many? No, 904. There you go. Look. So we've got 904 items. And that's doing its thing. Let's fly back up quickly. Wrong uh, wrong corner. Fly back up. And in theory, we should be getting stuff in this ender chest now. In theory. Once it starts working. Hopefully it will work. Let me just go down and just double check that that is pulling out. Oh, it's not. It's not pulling out. Eject. Pull. Oh, it's not. It's not going into the... Uh, it's not going... What's that? Disabled high. That's on low. Off. There we go. So it's mining, so it's getting diamonds, it's getting redstone, it's getting electrical, but why isn't it pulling it into the, why isn't it going out into the, do I need, a, do I need some kind of, do I need to pull it out somehow? Because if that's the case, that is going to fill up very quickly. That's not a problem, we are getting stuff, but this is going to be full, isn't it, before we, before we get anywhere. Um, silk touch, how do we pull out of here? What, what do we need? What, what, what is this? This is, this is mechanism, isn't it, digital miner? So, uh... What 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 mechanism, what mechanism pipes can we use to pull? Is it these things, logistical transporters? How do you make them? Steel and left shift. Capable of transferring transferring items and blocks. Maybe we could try that. Steel and electrical circuit. Let's just quickly try that then. Let's see if that works. I may need to have some other way of doing it as well. I'm not sure. We'll try. Um, steel and electric circuit. Electric circuit we can make. So we have one. Um, and just need two bits of steel then and we can make some of those and we'll try it. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. 
Let's give it a go. So all we can do is give it a go. So I've used it where we had um, wooden transport pipes before, and they were they were much easier to use. I've always used those in previous uh, series. There we go. Let's just try some of them. Basic logistical transport pipes. That might work. It might need an engine. In the past, we've had to use an engine to suck out the stuff. But this has got auto pull. This digital miner. So it might work okay. Let's have a look. Let's pick you up. Boom. And let's put you on there. Oh, let's put you on there. Is that going to work? Is that going to work? I don't think it is. No, it doesn't look it is. So we're getting the ores, you see. They're being they're being um, taken out complete so we can then still smelt them, um, still pulverize those. Hmm. So pull, let's let's turn pull off. Does that help? No. Uh does it have to come out the maybe it comes out the back maybe. Let's just take the thing and put it out the back. Hang on. Let's put it out the back to see if that makes any difference at all. Aha, there we go, it does work. Okay, right, we don't need those then. Gonna try that first, but that's not the end of the world. Right, so that's now going in there, which means that it will be able to go in here as well, which is perfect. So now it saves us having to run downstairs every time. We've got all our stuff here. We can let that do its thing. That's perfect. So we now have a really good system for um, for getting stuff out of the world. And as you'll see, it will start taking all the stuff from local areas and, and it will come in. It's still got 857 to do, so it's going to take us no time at all. One, if, if the ender chest does fill up, it will fill up in here. Then I think it stops mining, I think. I don't think it... Oh, hang on, auto-eject. Hang on, auto-eject. Let's try... Just turn the auto eject off a minute and see if that. No, it doesn't. Okay, we need auto eject on then. Auto eject on and auto pull. We'll leave auto pull off for now, as that is definitely working. See, we're getting loads of stuff. Six diamonds already. So things like that is really helpful with. Let's put some. Uh, let's put a couple of blocks there just to tidy that up. So we've got power coming down, and then obviously I'll have to move this. I will need some form of better. Uh, some form of better power more power that i can use i might just have to get like a um take those power cables and make a second wind turbine perhaps just to uh just to actually while we're doing that i'm going to take the take this off and i'm going to charge this up a bit more while we're waiting that can do its thing because that's going to take some time does the power drop on this power staying that's good water's full this is this isn't going up we're not making more We've got power and we've got water. Oh, that's because that's... Yeah. I see, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, we need to dump the excess. Always dump the excess oxygen then. That's fine. And then that can then... That will start filling up all the time. Yes. Okay, that's good. Uh, was that's, We still need to dump then. That's cool. That's cool. Right, let's let's look at wind turbines. Because when we, when we move the... Um, when we move the wind uh, generator, as they're called now. Uh, Osmium, we can make another one almost straight away, can't we, really? Yeah, I think we we'll, we we'll need to make another one of those at some point. When we move the generator, when we move the um the miner rather, we will probably end up having to. Uh, oh no, I'm gonna die. Well, I'm not gonna die. I'm not gonna be able to get out. But um, that's okay. That's okay. We're okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Don't panic. We can just teleport. We can just teleport. It's okay. Uh, teleport. Why can't I? Oh, why can't I teleport? Teleport. Teleport. That was lucky. Lucky I lucky <laughs> lucky I had teleportation set up. Otherwise, I'd have been mining my way out for all eternity. Um, there you go, guys. We have made good progress. We've made our couple of ender chests. We've made our, our digital miner work. That's down there working away. We've got our electrolytic, electrolytic separator making us hydrogen for our jetpack. We're doing okay. So in the next episode, I'm going to look into what more things we can do. Maybe go for an explore, find some new world, find some new areas. Um, and yeah, and see what the world has to offer us. So thank you very much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed. Don't forget to keep your comments, your lovely comments and suggestions coming in to get onto the wall of recognition. And I will see you soon for another episode of Snake's New Adventure. Cheers, guys. Bye.